Is what no mama? The peas bun up. Johnny wanna start. What do you mean the peas bun up? It's like this team has had too much fear, you know, cause I could have that make I couldn't even remember so the thing that pan John that man I forgot face Babylon pan a Sunday like this. It's where more late. The same place I always keep it, man. You see all you now, John. I go up on the road, go deal with all Babylon and I tell you. Look, Panja creation, man. Rastafari, no. Ja. Rastafari. Give thanks and praise, you know. Ready for God's face, soul, Babylon, you know. Remember the peas, Bridget? Yes, man. Link all the one tall. It's the man. Jump, 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 Oh, go on. I'm on there still in it. So I'm telling you, don't need that we have to I, I don't need that, you know. You know, I can only give the eye 50% of that right now. 50%? I will take that still. Hurry up. And yeah. I have a good job. I will take that too. Sure. So sure. what are you up to? You know what I say? And then I doubt I steam this morning and the peas I'm forgetting you know, the major fall things, you know. It burn up, so I gotta look some peas up the road. Well, chat on. I give thanks, you know. Bless thee. Yes. Roots. Bless thee. Yes, yeah, so you yeah, mean yeah. good? Yeah, man, with the I know. Yeah, man, give thanks, man. Yeah. So the item stay. Well, you know. I make a wheel go up the road, yes, you know? No watch no face. Watch no Bridging and bridging. Yeah, yes, man, no, bless no, thee, no. man. What's going on? I don't have to prepare a session later. Yeah, so who's not playing for? You, uh, my name is Kranix. Yes, sir. Oh, are you there? I'm yeah. going good, you know? True, true. Yeah, so man, I give time. First, I put some of the herb that I have now. Oh, you know what I have now? I can't hide the smell. Okay. It's strong, true. strong. You know, I give thanks and praise the same speed, you know, all day. I mean, Love the aroma. Give thanks and praise. So I a chat go up the hills, I say, no? Nice east and second season of Trump with beast. Mr. Officer Man, what you want from me? Yeah, right. 
Taliban. Yes, and him sure say me got it, man. Ah, and him a search for a spliff, could find it. Never know say me is a talisman. This is a recent thing and an chronic one. Oh, this is an ancient tradition. Oh, it is a gift to the wise and a long time. Them a steam in Afghanistan. Indian and Pakistan. Oh, yeah. Not to mention Africa. Oh, the best indeed in a West Indies. Burning by the rivers of Babylon. West Milan, everybody swat. West in the rain, Panama, Jika. So Mr. Officer make me talk loud because of the same man in a chronic spot. And I don't know it going to work out with the rest of my life. Yeah. Say, yes, I've up. been steaming oh, from home. Till my eyes got real. And I don't got no more. Can I do for myself? Rasta man be loud. Man, we love. Come over here. And I say, Officer, ease out. Ease out. Don't you have no fear. Officer, ease out and don't you judge me by my hair. Officer is out, don't you have no fear. Officer is out and don't you touch me by my hair. Regular walking pants on the morning, everything nice and peace. Me just tried in figure me yard, figure put on me rice and peas. One martinique up the road with me and the old blue sea. All inspector pan get grease, I ready so DC don't stir my peace. And Box cover the eye, front eye. Just cool, man. No we car challenge design, it's just high, man. So the eye has sweat, so. You want to see some Babylon boy around the mine, I all dash your eye piece. You know, see, I don't know why I'm going till I impress. So jump on the lot and walk me to the car. Sure. Why are you so fast, man? Yo, look, I can see what I'm eating. I tell. I tell it's vital, tell, you know, man. I tell look, I'm going to party some other. Yeah. All of them Babylon boys are here. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go All the time, you know? And I say give thanks, you know? From morning, they run out of the... You can't catch eye. You can't catch eye. See all that 50% of your eye? I will bring that back to you, you know? Keep that, man. Bless! Respect all the time. All day.
Here we go. One, two, one, two, three. Rebel against the kings of Babylon. Rebel against the kings of Babylon. Yeah, we got the swords and the spears and the bows and the knives, but we're fighting with our brothers and our sisters for our lives. Rebel against the kings of Babylon. Yeah. Previously, Sergeant Scagnetti, longing for days past when Ska ruled the world and kids weren't so forward, turns to desperate measures and builds a time machine to go back to the glory days of 1999. Oh, I'm looking for Sergeant Scagnetti. That band died in 1999, just like my beeper. Elliot embarks on a fruitless search around the New Haven scene before also jumping headfirst into the space-time continuum. Will our beloved heroes reach their quantum destination? Not quite. Steve. Your time machine didn't work. This is not 1999. No, this is not 1999. Because his pants wouldn't be that tight. And why the hell do you got a chainsaw? No, Steve, this is not 1999. Because of that Y2K bug. Why is everyone still blaming me for that shit after 21 years? Gone. So now what? Uh... I don't know. Where's my kid? He should be right behind us. You let your kid near that? Oh, oh jackass. Oh, human fart. Idiot. Dad, you're not a bozo, and this is not 1999. What is it, then? The void. The creative void, to be exact. A lot of people are in it right now. Creative void? This is Freddy's boiler room. Oh, I met these guys on the dark web. They seem pretty cool. What's the dark web? Probably some video game or something? <laughs> anyway, this is the way. The Puppetizer 2001, not only will it make you more talented, but also better looking. So line up and hold still. Legitimate science. I'm not so sure about this. Do it. I don't know how this is going to get us back to 2021. I don't think it matters.
your kids to us. Shoot them in a rocket that'll meet up with a comet that'll travel back in time so they can buy all our CDs. So, now that this is done, can we go home and not be puppets anymore? Don't worry, it'll wear off. Eventually. <laughs> I reprogrammed this thing. I think I got it. To wherever you may be, I am your host, MC Cooley Ranks, or affectionately known as Cooley. Well, I go on to everyone in the place to be. We just ran through a couple of videos there. Uh, Chronics, yeah, man, bad, 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 bad. Uh, Kill Lincoln, bad, 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 bad. Interrupters, bad, 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 bad. Sad Skagnetti, bad, 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 bad. Thought I was having a combination there with a. Uh, Interrupters and uh, the Boston's, but unfortunately, it was not a video. So, sorry, go. How are we doing here on a Friday, ladies and gentlemen? Yes, it is Friday, but once again, I'll give you the date. It is June the 18th. A new law has been passed in America to uh, celebrate the freedom of former slaves of the USA. It is called June 19th, which is the actual date when they were informed that they were actually free. Um, so much time had gone by, which they did. They weren't aware that it was actually a thing. But then, you know, we jumped into Jim Crow and other things that kept people, the sus, the sus laws uh, that kept people in uh, bondage and slavery. Uh, this was America at the time. And today, the the big arguments are, let's see, to teach uh, critical theory, I think it is. Is it critical theory? Crit Critical race theory. There you go. Excuse me. Thank you. Thank you, Jason. Getting the words out. Well, I, I don't understand. If you're going to give you, if you're going to actually submit to having a national holiday in, in regards to slavery, then why not discuss the whole thing and everything else that under the sun? Because at some point, they're going to grow up and the wool will be taken over their eyes. Would they, is it that they want to keep the wool over people's eyes? I'm, 
I am just an outsider looking in. You can make the decision of your own because this is the great place called America, which we live in. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you again. Polit politics aside, I really like this song. I know, and I'm and I'm and I'm walking in a on a tightrope here when I play this song here, and, and the reason why. I say that is because she's not from the scene, but I really like this the song, and that's a debate that which or well, a question I would I will ask everyone because there are people that are entering into our scene who are not of our scene. So, I mean, you know, we have an open door policy. I believe we have an open door policy. What, what, right, Chris? You think it's an open door policy? Everyone is welcome. All right, so it's fair, it's fair to say it's an open door policy in SCA. So everyone is welcome. Just to respect the legacy and the history and, and what it stands for. Because then again, you know, you'll have people that will come in and just bastardize the music. And so I don't know, without, without any further ado, we're going to talk about that a little bit later. But that's my point on that thing, and that's my thing. But I really like this, this song. And again, she's not from the scene, but she's doing it very well so you listen to the song uh, any opinions on it let me know i'm gonna play some more songs like this in regards to where we at peace this thing called transparent soul by willow <laughs> give me some volume on that because i love that shit oh yeah mean yeah that turn up the song I am in. Get used to this if you haven't heard it already. I played the video a couple of weeks back. But I love this tune. Let's go. Hey, hey. Do you have room to turn up your computer volume a little bit? Clyde is in the building. Luke King is in the building. Scott's in the building. Scott Kid is in the building. We're speaking each and every one in the place. You heard the topic, right? Tell me if it's all right for us. Who's going to the scene to be in the scene? Is it an exploitation or is it just a big up? Is it just cool to be a Let's go! Uh, 25, ladies and gentlemen. Hey there, people. This is Dandy Livingstone. You're listening to Car Radio Sessions 2035 with your host, Cooley Ranks. Hey, what's going on? This is Kristen Forbes, aka Lady Hatchet. Of Dennis in the building. Step one. Yeah, so that's that's one of them. Let me get that that girl go scar video. With all those like the checkered chicks. So here we go again. I'm 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 gonna put this out there again because I I, I want to know what the thoughts are. Is it just cool to be us now? Or are they just biting for the sake of biting? Is it cool to be us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Dan is in the building. Clive is in the building. Scott Kid, seven eighty nine is in the building. Rude King is in the building. Yeah, I'm gonna big up yourself. We got some. Ah, uh, yay, Scott Kid. So, what's your thought? Is it just cool to be us, or is uh, is Scott a trend now? Is is I'm just trying to figure it out. Is Scott a trend now? Is it trendy to be Scott? Because uh, the history of Scott. Oh, go on, go on, go on there, go on there, Chris. You can cut me off. That was a question. Someone says to me, that's a loaded question. Clyde said, that's a loaded question. Um, Dan says, man, I'm feeling, I'm falling back in love with Scar again. As if you have ever fallen out of love with Scar, Dan. <laughs> How could you say that? Rhonda, live. Oh, I think you say love this. Yes. And Johnny uh, Root King says, uh, sorry, 20 years and things come back around. Uh, Nimrod, what's up, Cooley? What's up, my brother? Well, let me tackle all of these questions. I, I kind of, I like, I like where it's going. The twenty-year thing. I'm not. I've heard that saying before, and there is something to be said about that. I'm not a hundred percent in with that. I think, I think um, what it has done, what what Scar has done, which other music hasn't done in the same format. In some ways, it has, but it's foundation. Scar's foundation is uh, unity. It's like, that's that's it. So during this COVID, remember we were playing Scar last year and the year before that we were playing Scar. But during this COVID, um, I think what happened was people actually got a chance to fall back on what made them happy when they were younger because they were in the house, you know what I mean? So they they fell back in, they, as you're saying here, Dan, you fell back in love. They fell back into seeing the times that what were making them happy and Scar was definitely on their list. And what music stood up for unity and, and racial equality? 
from the beginning. So for me, this, this is just my point of view. What music stood up for racial equality and unity? It's with Scott all the time. So I think it's kind of cool now to wear these black and white checkers. And then maybe there's a, maybe there's a, a following of the backdrop of why these checkers are there. That's why people are discovering Scott. I don't know. Dan says, totally agree there, man. My oldest kid is super into ska punk right now. He's 15. He's listening to some newer bands and are pretty damn great, but mostly listen to the same bands listening to. It's so awesome to watch. Uh, uh, Dan also says the ska documentary about the 90s ska is amazing. If anyone here hasn't seen it, you should. It's on Amazon. It features, yes, uh, self, self plug there. It features me in that too. Uh, Rude King says, let me be clear. Ska never left and has, has been all around all this time. I'm talking about the media going to try to bring it back. Ah, oh. oh, okay. Okay, I, I dig that one there, Mr. Rude King. Uh, Clive says XD. Sorry, Clive, I don't have that uh, emoji on XD. I think that's a smile. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen. It is a loaded question. I know it is a loaded question, but it has is a question that has to be asked because it, you know, this is this has been the, the scene. So I'm not the gatekeeper, of course not, but I would like to see who's coming in and what's their what's their purpose and what's their intentions. Because this music has been uh this music has been a safe hold for me, a safe haven for me, where I came out of the hood and you know, had to, I was able to put down my gun and put down, pick up my microphone and do music. So I kind of, I kind of, you know, uh, I'm protective over it because this it was protective to me. So let's not let's not disrespect this music. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. If you want to come and come through, but don't disrespect the music and take it someplace else where it, it was never meant to go. Having said that, I'm gonna play a new artist here. <laughs> I'm taking it way where we're not supposed to go. But uh, she's on the scene. She's in the scene, so I'm going to play her. And her band is called Cranberry Bat Cave. We played one of her tunes during the COVID, the whole uh, beginning of our car sessions. So I'm going to drop her latest tune, her and the band here. This one is called Restless. Hang tight, listen up, and enjoy. Peace. Bat Cave. Cranberry Bat Cave. Let's go. Nice and easy. Let me turn up this song. All right, brand new. Let's go. Give yourself back. Emmy.
Yes, ladies and gentlemen, we're joined. Yeah, we're joined here. We got well, well, halfway finished. Halfway finished today. So we have some new challenges for you guys out there today. I'm looking, I'm looking at the responses and I'm, I'm going to definitely address those guys. That was tight. You're damn right it was tight. Oh, there she goes right there. There she goes. Cat Batista. Thank you. Thank you so much for the Cranberry Bat Cave. That one that was called Restless. She's in the building. Big up yourself, Cat, in the building. You're done, Noah. So, so listen, I got a challenge for you guys. We're going we're gonna to change the format up just a little bit. We're sending out some invitations to some of you uh, sound guys. I don't know if you guys got sounds. You know what the sound is? Okay, if you have a DJ component and you spin music in your house, we will be inviting a few of you out there to try something new with us. I have a couple of people in mind already who I've spoken to, and we shall see. Spin some music here with us. Um, Scar Kid 789 says it's definitely becoming a refocus on its popularity. However, all those who are in full skank, he he, will continue to grow and respect its growth. Love that. Uh, Real clear, I, I got yours. He said the whole Bad Times record Scar Tune Network group is gaining traction and breaking through right now. Yeah, they're doing a great job. They're, they're fucking great with the the social media and all of that stuff is great. Uh, Cat totally forget. Mikey D. Looper says that was tight. Thank you. That wasn't me. That was a uh, Cat Baptista. If you see her there, and that would be the Cranberry Bat Cave. So we've got a couple more minutes to go here. Let's let's drop a couple more tunes. Um, in fact, as you were speaking about um, what's this? I have something here. I don't know. What is this? Let me try this, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna spin something blindly. I don't. I I just saw this in my book. I'm just gonna spin it. This is the first show from the UK. Come on, call it Greg. It's the summertime, so come on, everyone. Grab a cup of wine and come and chill out in the sun. We'll have some barbecue, we'll put some reggae on. All right. The vibe just right to spread the word to everyone. There it is in the building. thought I had another one here. I had another one lined up here because I was trying to find all the scar coming out of Jamaica, right? I, I mean, like current scar coming out of Jamaica, which I could not find. It was like looking for a needle in a haystack. But I did. There, 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 there's, there's some artists that are doing scar individually, like not, not, not like every scar, every song is a scar, but they may have one or two scar songs which you know i was i was digging for those ones and it's so difficult to find it online i, I couldn't find it but what I, I did find one i did find one which which i like and i've been listening to it quite a bit so uh with no further ado i'm a big in the morning car boy joe it was seen the real key of the oh. jealousy. I before i go any further let me let me not skip over the legend that he is king stitch our first dj yeah man King Stitch, big up, big up, King Stitch, yeah. It was seen the real king of the not jealousy. I King Stitch, the first of my new quenched all musical dirt. 
That's our first MC right there. King Stitch. Let's go, Jamaica stand up. I mean, England stand up, Jamaica stand up, Africa stand up, New York stand up, America stand up. Hey, let's go. Hi, this is Teresa from the Caribbean Soul Steppers, and you're listening to Car Sessions 2035 with Cool Red. So we are coming close, closer to the summer where all the shows shall start to commence. Big news, I was informed today by the man called Chris Joyard that uh, Hepcat is back on Supernova headlining a night. Officially, which night? We don't know, but it shall be. I guess I, I think it's going to be. It's going to be. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so uh, it's gonna it's be going to be Sunday. We shall they're... have uh, Hepcat on the show. So look forward to that summer. This is 7, September the 17th, 18th, and 19th in Virginia. If you haven't gotten your ticket yet, uh, I advise you to get your ticket. And if you don't have a place to sleep, bring a tent. Uh, they're playing Sunday because they're playing Riot Fest on Saturday. So okay, their so headline play, is Sunday. Okay, they're going to play Sunday. Ladies and gentlemen, I say to you, get a tent, get a ticket. If you don't have means right now, you better charge it on your, your credit card. Or borrow one. Yeah, it's going to be like that. And do remember, we have a show, Pilfers, that is Pilfers NYC. We are playing uh, September, ooh, we are playing August the 6th and August the 7th, the 7th, Connecticut and uh, Pennsylvania. And then we are playing again, Supernova headlining a night, uh, September the 17th. So we'll be there. And um, just to know, Vinny says he's coming out. So, 
That will be uh, the dynamic duo on stage. All right, so let's play some of those new, those young ones that we love. We love these guys here too because we know we know Tim from a long time, and Tim did a good thing. We shall. I think we're going out on this one. Best believe I'm coming to Supernova. Very cool. Very cool there, Scar Kids 789. Uh, let me shout out to everyone that is here. If you're not on the the, uh, the YouTube page or the Real Rebel Radio, I think we're even on Twitch today. Yeah, we're on Twitch today. Ladies and gentlemen, shout out to the Twitch crew and then the Twitch, Twitch crew in the building. Just big up yourself. Uh, yes. Oh. I made a shout out to my boys before I leave here. Yeah, there we go. The restream there. There's the YouTube page. Before I go blank. <laughs> Chris Ryan has JamaicaSounds.com. Uh, Johnny Bravo has... Johnny Bravo. Come on, man. I'm joining blank. The Scar Podcast. It's a talk. It's a talk. Johnny Bravo, please just put it in there. Put it in there so I can shout it out, please. I'll wait for a second. Yeah, so I, I like to thank everyone that's been tuning in. And, you know, as I said, we're going to switch up the program a little bit and invite a few more people in and do a little different things here because I'm, I'm one of them dudes that hate the same old, same old. Talk with Mr. Kingpin. There you go. Talk with Mr. Kingpin podcast. Ladies and gentlemen, we got uh, one, more, one more video, right? Is it one more? Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's do let's do girls go scar and let's, then we do cat bite. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much and hang tight. We'll see you guys next week, uh, two thirty to three thirty next week, Friday. Thank you again. My name is Cooler Ranks. Yeah, I'm an original Cooler Ranks from nineties. Yeah, peace, 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 peace. And my host, my guest over there, my guest. Oh, huh? Oh, oh. Oh. Cuando decide imponerse y se escurre entre tus pasos. Cuando van los sueños rasos. No cuando el uno buscar. se hace un dos. Y aunque se quiebre la voz, cuando vuela el desencanto, no se debe esperar tanto para decirnos adiós. Quiero dejar de escuchar las palabras de amor de mágica.
las cosas El cielo y la tierra Si las cosas del cielo y la tierra No duran eternamente ¿Cómo las del hombre? ¿Cómo las del hombre? 